the average venture capitalist is so overwhelmed by the promise of what they're seeing right in front of them that they just sort of assume that there's going to be a great exit. But they haven't mapped it out. And one of the things that uh, John Warden does that is very, very instructive is he picks five years out as the exit point. You can pick any exit point you want. You can pick three years, you can pick seven years. But forcing a team to draw five, a five-year exit on the wall and then working backwards to how are you going to get to that point causes much more solid thinking. You know, uh, Are you going to be an IPO? Are you going to be a strategic acquisition? Who were the targets? Usually people put that off. You know, people, people just like focusing on what's in front of them. So, so uh, John Warden's theories have a, a very beneficial effect of forcing people to actually focus on the specific means of success. We call this a future back approach. We always start with the future we intend to create and we always give it a time frame. If there's no time frame, there is no strategy. Now the user can choose the time frame, but it needs to be long enough to make strategic change and not so long as to be meaningless to people in the organization.